Good afternoon. Sharing some messages from the book. Karen, I think you want to share something about self-sabotage. Yes. It sounds terrible. It is. It's a terrible thing and most of us have experienced it. Um, I employ someone who's never experienced it to reach out to us because I'd love to know uh, their secrets and share them in the book before we finish it. But um, self-sabotage is something that we do because we don't feel worthy enough or loved enough or smart enough or whatever enough. So you can do it in a job, you can do it in a relationship, just about anywhere that you put the, the idea in your mind that you're not good enough for something, you're going to sabotage it. Um, because again, we've talked about your words being so important. And if you're admitting to the universe that, um, oh, I wish I had a relationship, that's what I really want. What you're really saying is, I don't have a relationship. I don't have love in my life. And what you need to do is get yourself to a point where you're so happy with yourself. You feel that great self-love and that's why all the other things that we talk about like meditation, mindfulness, gratefulness, great health mm -hmm. are so important to your core being so that you don't self-sabotage so that what you're putting out to the universe is all the goodness that you're looking to get back in. I and there's that's good. Yeah, a little, little surprise about the book and, and what we're writing about. Wishing you great health, abundant happiness and outrageous love from Costa Rica.